Welcome back to the channel, everybody. My name is Chief Twenty. You're watching part twelve of my Stardew Valley playthrough. Let's get after it. Okay, guys. Part twelve. Part twelve. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get the old watering can out. Oh my goodness, this is gonna take us a while. This was a bad idea. This is a lot of stuff to water with one small watering can, but here we are. We can't, we can't not do it. Best quitter complaining and just get it done. We need to get ourselves some irrigation. That's what we need. That would be real handy, but it's very expensive at this point because we are not super deep in the mine yet as to have a ton of steel. So. But don't worry, we're well on our way. Gotta refill real quick here. Boom. All right, Let's finish this up quick. Grab some eggs from the chickens. And we will keep on moving. Man, this is quite the garden now. I am gonna enjoy the rainy days, I think do all my work for me another thing is I'm pretty sure our pickaxe or our not pickaxe already have that our our wood cutting axe is ready to go so we can go pick that up from uh, from old Clint boy there he'll have it ready this is sweet we have our four chickens making us four eggs a day beautiful I don't think we have uh any ink, any uh, nuggets left? Oh, we do. We can make an iron. This so we can make a steel ingot. So that's sweet. How much will that be? We have all of six of them. Okay, so we could definitely upgrade something to a. Uh... Well, this is iron. Okay. Well, we'll have enough uh, iron bars to upgrade something to iron if we wanted. So that's chill. Let's get some. Some wood in the old kiln. Now, let's go pick up that uh, that axe because we need it. We got some stuff to do today. We've been using uh, oh an arrowhead. Cool, we can drop that off with the Gunther or Gunther, however you prefer to say it. But uh, yeah, we need wood, and we dropped our axe off right when we needed wood, so. You snooze, you lose, and I was clearly on the old snooze, but that's okay. We got her back today, and we'll get some. Uh, we'll get our wood stores right back up. You don't realize how how uh, much you need wood until your axe is gone. All right, let's donate this arrowhead here. Nice, got our new reward finally. What do we get? A night on Echo Hill. Cool. A little picture. Have in our house. Make us a little classier. Grab the old sweet pea. Yeah. There we go. Now, what can we upgrade? Copper hoe. Don't really care about that right now, but we can upgrade our... Uh, we could upgrade to steel now if we wanted to. Well, <laughs> provided we have five grand, which we most definitely don't have, but that's okay. I'm sure we'll get there soon enough. Now that we're actually growing some things and have a little bit of a farm slash garden going. Look at the beach is full of stuff today. Nice. Well, that's awesome. I can't say I expected the beach to have too much today. Seems like in the summer here we're not getting as lucky with things. But that's okay. We're not so dependent on our scavenging money anymore. Although it is nice. A little bit of a side hustle. Always good to have a side hustle. We'll 
we'll get back home here we'll throw all that stuff we have into the for sale bin um let's go talk to marnie quick gift her an egg because we still have to get them shorts back just to keep the storyline a moving so we'll keep that going in a little bit here we'll venture on down there I'm glad we have our axe back though that's a big deal speaking of that let's put the uh... yeah requires five that's what I figured perfect okay so let's actually go drop this picture off get it out of our inventory move this one over to here she might move this one right there beautiful how nice look at us house is looking so much better okay let's put this sweet pea in our chest because why not? Always good to have a sweet pea on hand. There we go. Well, that's a decent living we've already made today. Only halfway through the day. That's what I'm talking about. Making that morning money. The early bird gets the worm. And let me tell you what, we were the early bird today. Boom, some clay as well. Nice. All right, so let's go give an egg to, to old Marnie here. I wonder, oh, you know what? I wonder how we're doing for clay. No, not clay, I wonder how we're doing for hay is what I meant. Shoot, Marnie's already gone. I wonder what time they close, I can't remember. I think she travels to the city every day. I'm not sure what she does, but I think she, or the town, I should say, not city. But she travels there every day to do something. And what that something is has eluded my mind as of right now. I'm sure she's up to, up to no good. We'll be going and hanging out with Lewis. All right. Well, may as well cut some wood while we're at it. Doesn't seem to have increased our wood cutting uh, speed by any. Not that I remember. But no big deal. Not too worried about it. Although I did expect it to probably two hit trees or something, but it's alright. She still gets the job done. Speaking of that, we have to go feed, we have to go feed those dang chickens. I totally forgot to put more hay in their, in their spot today. Ah, darn it, quite a bit of it fell into the map there. Axe isn't strong enough to break this part of the log. Dang. At least it's not taking too long to get uh, our wood stores up. It's pretty quick. I think we should be, yeah, we'll be close to 100 already. Just off this little bit we're doing here. So that's not too bad. Our energy is very low though. Okay, well, I guess that's where we're gonna leave that because our energy is dangerously low. Let's go see if we have anything in the silo. I don't think we do. Oh, 11. Okay, well, at least we'll get through today. <laughs> we'll get through today. Beauty. Awesome. Now, let's rip real quick down to Marnie's before 5 if we can make it. I don't know if we will. We'll see if she's sitting there. That would suck to miss this. I was really hoping to get well, at least one gift to her today. Nope. Oh, there she is. Yep. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. She might have been in there the whole time. I just never saw her. 
Okay, cool. So Marnie got her gift. Perfect. So at least we got that done, because that's kind of a big deal. We only need one more heart with her before we are allowed to enter her bedroom and snag those shorts of Mayor Lewis's. So that'll be good. Keep things moving a little bit. Look at Beast over there just sleeping away. He's a happy pupper. Real happy pupper. Get that wood in there. Get that. Oh, this has sap in it too. Let's see. What do we got? Oof, we have a lot of sap. You can make quite a bit of fertilizer. Put this egg in the old mayonnaise maker. Let's just keep making charcoal. You know what we could do is if we ventured up to the uh, hot springs, we could get our energy up and we could definitely go mining. I don't see why not. Wouldn't be the worst idea, because uh, getting some steel would be good, or some iron, I mean. Keep calling it steel. Sorry, guys. I'm just a goofball. I'm pretty sure it's iron until you use it to make your tools, and then it becomes steel. So, I don't know. I don't know how it works. Run! We gotta get in that hot spring now. We are going to... We're going to pass out from exhaustion. There we go. In the old trunks. <laughs> what a wonderful noise in here. Just sounds relaxing. And now we wait. As boring as that is, we wait. <laughs> Wouldn't this be nice? To have a free hot spring you can just go to and... Regain all of your energy. Looks wonderful to me. I would definitely love that. Although I have been to a couple hot springs here where I live. and uh, Well, not here where I live, but here in Canada I've been to a couple hot springs and they are a treat. Don't have any near me, but not that I know of. But they are uh, they're real nice. Coming off the ski hill or the snowboard hill, whatever you do in the winter, and hopping into those hot springs and just chilling out for a while is just wonderful. Because let me tell you what, you get pretty sore doing uh, doing some snowboarding, especially when you're learning because you're falling down constantly and hurting yourself, so hot springs is not a bad idea. All right, just getting some of this fiber because why not? All right, let's head down to the to the local mine. See what they've got going on there. I'd also like to see what uh, go take a look at the Adventurers Guild again, just so we know what we're doing to get another sword. I'm not sure what the cost is. I always forget, so we'll go take a look there quick too before we enter the mine. I think they close at ten, so let's get over there right now. 10 or 11, I can't remember. Greetings. Oh no, here we go. So the Claymore's minus 4 speed, but man, it hits like a beast. Cutlass does 9 to 17, 20 to 32. Oh, plus 2 speed though. I feel like rocking the, uh, the Cutlass is a good idea sell that perfect now is there anything else we should buy amethyst ring increases knockback by 10 percent topaz increases weapon precision by 10 percent aquamarine by 10 percent you know what let's go topaz we'll rock the topaz for now let's see if we can talk to this old boy oh didn't want to hit him Oof, wow. Well, we're, not, we're not too far on the cave insects. That's these. Cool. Well, we got a better sword now, so that's a bonus. I'm not sure how we wear the ring. Oh, right there. Figured it out. I need to look before opening my mouth. 
Oops. What am I doing? I want to go down the elevator. I want to be up here. Drop right down to 50. See if we can get to 55 right now. I haven't seen a ghost yet, I don't think. I think it's the first time we've met one. We'll get rid of him ASAP. Oh, see that hit that thing real hard. Solar essence. Didn't know that was a thing. The more you know. Yeah, this is much better. Way more efficient. So that's awesome. Because man, did it ever take a lot of hits to kill these things before. Let's see how long it takes to kill these guys. Oh, it's much faster. Right on. That's exciting. And it wasn't even that expensive, to be honest. I expected way worse. Bat wings. Nice. All right, let's get to level 55. to sneak off into the corner might have been a little easter egg but nope a little bit of jade there cool Ooh, what do we got here never seen this before whoa that's a lot of coal nice it's getting late you're getting late i can't remember what's gonna happen to us if we uh, stay out too late i think something happens i thought you passed out or something but It takes a while to kill these ghosts because you knock them back so dang far. I like how it's super gusty in this cave. Man, this ghost. There we go. Ghost fish? What the heck is a ghost fish? Weird. I think we're probably supposed to go home, but I can't tell. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. Whatever, we'll just keep on pushing. If we pass out, we pass out. It is what it is. I was kind of hoping that ghost was going to be the, uh, the ladder, but I was wrong. Very wrong. There we go. Nice. Ooh. This looks like there's going to be a few things to mine. Wow. Sweet. And an easy way down to level 55, which is good too. Our inventory... Oh, see? Yep, I passed out. Dang it. And our inventory was full too. That blows. We worked too hard, ladies and gentlemen. We worked too hard. I don't know if the cave is a good place to sit down and go sleep though. Not that we lose anything, that's the question. Oh, we got a bunch of solar essence, so we obviously didn't. Inventory is full. Winter root, jade will keep that. Ghost fish, a pale blind fish found in underground lakes. So that ghost was trying to be eaten good. Oh, I see, we have sap in here. I'm a goof. Bat wings are in here too. I wonder what we're doing with monster slime. I swear we had bat wings over here. Yeah, we do. Dang it. We got a bunch of double places going on here. Refined quartz. Ooh, we can actually put this right into the... Uh, right into the oven. I see we sell the fish. No. Eat that into there. Get the coal in here. Solar essence. Frozen tear. We should have brought those to the to the guy to sell. Hmm. That's right. We'll get them next time. That's no big deal. Let's actually put this sap in here because that's gonna bother me if there's two spots. Let's see, what we got. You're lucky. I found you last night. You were unconscious, and someone was searching your pockets. Oh, I know how much money they took. Oh, 
They run away as soon as I approach. Be more careful. Okay, I didn't realize that was the case. Somebody was searching our pockets in the mine. That's spooky. It's probably a ghost. Thank goodness for Linus, hey? He's just chilling in the mine. What a good old boy. He's always watching out for everybody. It's gonna be tough to tell what I've watered with all these uh, plants growing so tall. Obviously give the, the uh, scarecrow a drink. Never leave a scarecrow behind. Fill up the water can here quick. Boom. There we go. Man, this is a lot of watering. Alright. At least we're over halfway. The furnace is just just red hot, hey? Wow. Takes a lot to smelt a little bit of uh, iron there. All right, let's grab a little bit of, a little bit more water. So it's, oops, no, didn't want to water the chicken. It's watered now. Hopefully it grows big and strong. Let's throw that iron bar in here. That is sweet that we got that new sword though. I'm feeling pretty good about that. Get the hay out here. Boom. Then you're gonna eat another day. Get this in here. Boom. Alright. Sitting pretty good. Let's go see if Marnie's open. Let's go see if her shop's open for business so we can give her a gift. What do we got here? Oops, that's not what I want. I want to see social. Oh good, today is the day. We should be able to enter her bedroom in order to get those shorts back. Martin, where are you at though, girl? Oh, she's in her bedroom, dang it. Oh, we're so close, Marty. Get out here. Just hoping she'd be uh, moved. <laughs> It's worth a shot. You know what? Let's just scavenge real quick while we're waiting. I'm gonna wait till 10 o'clock and see if that changes her position. Because that would be real helpful if she would be behind the counter. Just saying. I'm trying to force her to get to work or anything, but Marnie, get to work. Boom, bada bing. There we go. All right, let's see if Marnie's back at the old, the old station here. Where is she though? Dang. Marnie, who's, where are you gonna buy stuff? Oh, it's frustrating. Try one more time at 11 o'clock here. It's probably a long shot, but. Still no movement, hey? My god. Where's your dang mother, kid? What? Giggle. Alright. Alright. She's having a good time. She's having a fine time. Figured we just will clean up the yard a little bit. Since we're waiting for dang Marnie to get home. And do her job. Opens a shop, but it's never there. It's weird. Okay. Shall we try one more time? Marnie, please be at home. Please be home. Come on now. Wow. 
This is really annoying. Like, not just a little bit annoying. Very annoying. <laughs> well, I guess we're off to check the beach. Maybe we'll catch her in town. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what her route is, but... I might get lucky. It looks like we're not. It looks like we're gonna check the beach. Haley's up over there getting that hair bleached by the sun. I did expect that to give us a little bit of energy, but I was mistaken. At least the spice berry gave us a little bit of, a little bit of something. What do we got here? I don't even know what that is. The old cockle. Don't even know what a cockle is, but we got one now. That thing will be going up for sale. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Shoot. Oh, well, that gave us uh, that gave us uh, a gift thing with with her, so that's good. <laughs> Leah, you're welcome for giving you free coral I just found on the beach. I do what I can. I'm into giving expensive, luxurious gifts. I like to lavish the women of Stardew with beautiful gifts <laughs> that I found on the beach for free. Don't judge. Please be at home, Marnie. Make my day. Make my day. Please be at home. Come on, Marnie. We'll walk on down there. Come on. Let's hope we get lucky. Really? Oh my gosh. We went around four yesterday, so I guess we'll just wait till four. Cast the line. <laughs> Why not? Let's see if we can catch us a fish. Come on, fishy. Come on. Give the old bobber a niggle. An, uh, a little nibble action. Come on. Come on. Oh, boy. Someone's playing a little hard to get. Oh my gosh, that fish is annoying. But anyways, boom! Marnie should be home. Hopefully she's in her kitchen, just like yesterday. Come on, Marnie. She's not here! No way! You gotta be kidding me. What does Marnie do on Tuesdays? Hi, hello, hello. Marnie, please come home. This is ridiculous. This is absolutely ridiculous. This is the exact time we showed up yesterday. Like, do you think that if I just sit in here, she'll come in? I can't remember what time she's uh, open, so. Dang it, Marnie. Hmm. This is frustrating to say the least. I can't remember. Yeah, I just can't remember the time that she uh, comes home. Okay, it's Topaz under his pillow. It's a little weird. 
But hey, who am I to judge? Who am I to judge? Maybe it helps him a lot. I don't know enough about it. Okay, Marnie, you gotta be home by now. Let me let me guess. It's gonna be closed. Of course. That's just our luck. Just our luck. Marnie, you done screwed us today. Let me tell you what. I could have had both these both these eggs in the mayonnaise maker by now. But that's okay. We'll be alright. The day is not lost. What do we got here? Just a pine cone. Sleep this one off. A little bit more money made, guys. Day nine, day ten of summer, year one. Yeah. Anyways, guys, I know we didn't get the shorts this time. I really wanted to, but you know what? Marnie gave us the cold shoulder. If you enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe. And I will catch you on the next episode of Stardew Valley. Peace.